Hey YouTube, Mark Kaufman here, and today I want to show you a very unique Victorinox Executive, and that is this knife. Now, the Executive is a pretty interesting knife. You have a set of scissors here, and this one is probably from the late 1970s, because it has that single leaf spring. So you've got that single leaf spring, you have an orange peeler, you also have a main blade, and then you have a small pen blade. But what is very unique about this specific Victorinox Executive is the nail file. It has this textured finish on it instead of the cross cut file. And I have never seen a Victorinox executive with this file. It's very interesting to see this specific file texture on this knife because usually a Victorinox executive has this kind of file texture. And this is the cross cut texture. So for me, Seeing this texture on here leads me to believe that Victorinox was thinking about moving over to this textured finish because majority of their knives were actually having this type of finish on their nail files anyways. But you can see at the very end there, it didn't really fit. So I think they ended up moving back to the cross cut. It was very interesting to see this specific nail file because it's just very different to what you see on your standard Victorinox executives. I don't know why they decided to go with this kind of file because it really doesn't fit the knife. And one of the benefits of the cross cut is you can actually get to the very end of your fingernail. So you can actually get to the very tip, but with this specific file, you have a lot of space there. It's about a millimeter of space that is not a file for your fingernail. And it actually makes it a little more difficult to file your nails. Whereas on this one, when it meets your fingernail, it is going to cut it either way when you hit it to the very edge. Oh well, I don't know why. Victorinox ended up going with this one. It's just very unique, very different, and I've never seen it before. If you have one of these executive knives that has this finish, let me know in the comments. And if you know why they switched over to this kind of finish, please enlighten me and put that down in the comments. But I thought you guys would enjoy seeing this very different nail file on a Victorinox executive. So till the next one, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.